No, nah, they ain't about to just kill off my best friend like that. No. Nah. Tragic. Hi, and welcome to my channel. I'm Allie Fitz, and I'm back with another video. And if you're new here, hello, I love you already. Make sure you slap that subscribe button to become part of the Fitz fam today. We pretty lit, it's true. And once you've done that, make sure to follow my social medias over here to stay connected with your girl and turn on those post notifications so you know all the tea first. By the way, these drop tomorrow, so turn on those post notifications so you can get the first one because there's only a limited amount. And for those of you who don't know, my new song Tragic is now available on iTunes, Apple Music, and Spotify. And if we get it charting on the top 100 on iTunes, I will do a giveaway where you, or you, or you could win one of these awesome episode t-shirts right here and maybe even my merch too. So make sure you guys are buying, streaming, and downloading Tragic, asking your moms for iTunes gift cards so you can buy Tragic. Also, if you wanna join our Discord FitzFam group chat, all you have to do is tag me on Instagram or tweet me a screenshot of your purchase just like this, this is an example. And boom, I will message you the link and you can join our VIP FitzFam group chat. We be lit all the time in there. So yeah, we are back with episode and I'm so mad because they killed my best friend. Like, let's just jump on in now because I need to know if they killed her or not. I've been triggered all day. But first, let me give a special thank you to my episode donators who keep the game fun. So a special thank you to Kaylee Ficker and once again, Brianna LaFleur. Thank you so much, Brianna and Kaylee. Y'all the best. So without further ado, let's see if my friend is really dead or not. Is this real or a dream? Because nowadays I don't be knowing. Oh, I'm crying. I look cute though. I always say that. The palace is still reeling from the apparent drug overdose of Lily Von Morgan, the former lady-in-waiting to Prince Sebastian's American fiance. She really is dead. I'm so upset. With the possible future king's wedding planned for today, the kingdom waits with bated breath to see if the ceremony will happen at all. This sucks. Who did it? Watching the news can't be helping you. Nothing is gonna help me now. My best friend is dead. Of an overdose? I still don't believe it. Losing someone that important is hard. No, I mean, I don't believe that Lily would take drugs, ever. The coroner was quite certain about the cause of death. Then the coroner is lying. Whoever did this was trying to send me a warning. I'm sure they paid the doctor off. Allie, we've had a lot of shocks lately. You don't believe me? You told me yourself that Lily seemed upset the other day, and I know you had some kind of fight. Maybe she was more troubled than you realized? No, she wouldn't kill herself because of a fight. And wait, is he blaming me? Wait, are you saying I drove Lily to do this? What? No, Allie, of course not. Because if I could take back our fight, I would, for anything. I'm just worried about you. You should be. Now what is she doing here? In the long list of people I don't need to see right now, you're right at the top, Anastasia. Oh. So beat it. I hope you're not here to harass Allie. I'm here to get you to call off this wedding. Well, of course we're gonna call it off, mother. Allie just suffered a huge loss. No, I'm gonna go through with the wedding. T. What? Are you insane? If only because Anastasia doesn't want us to. Oh, you've always tried to keep us apart. Allie, I don't want our ceremony to be about revenge. It isn't, it's about love. And last night I lost a lot of love. So now I want to run towards yours. Lily would want us to do this, so it's settled. Oh, uh, go ahead, Allie, making plans. Okay, the queen mad, I know she is. I still can't believe Lily is dead. I'm so mad about that. She was so cute and I love doing her little voice. Her little voice was so cute. Felix? Allie, I didn't expect anyone to be down here. Shall I leave you alone? No, I'm glad you're here. I'm just freaking out about Lily. I can't imagine how you're feeling. It's awful. They're saying it was an overdose. Lily would have never touched drugs. See, you get it. Thank you for saying that. I guess this place has become sort of special for both of us. That's true. It also makes me think of my mom. I'm sorry I never met her. Me too, she would have loved you. Your spark, your spirit. How I keep you in line. Oh, T, you're not gonna take the bait? No banter at all? Come on, Felix. I really need something to feel normal right now. We're not normal, Allie. And the truth is, I came here to say goodbye to this old place. What? Goodbye? I'm leaving Basilia today. But I just lost my best friend. 
Or what about your brother? Ooh, if I say I just lost my best friend, that would be like so selfish, you know? I'm trying to be selfless, I guess. So what about your brother? Think about Sebastian. You're supposed to stand up for him. Sebastian will be relieved I'm not there. He knows the truth about us. You're still his brother. Exactly. Do you think I want to stand here and watch you marry him? It'll kill me. True. Felix, don't do this. Not now. I'm sorry. I hope you and your baby have a great life together. Wow, I'm losing everybody. Who's next, Sebastian? Let me not say that before he calls off the wedding. But this is goodbye, Allie. I give him a real goodbye with a kiss, convince him another way. Um, well, I did do another poll and you guys want me to stay with Sebastian again, which is cool. So I'm not gonna give him this kiss because that's just, that's just, no. Convince him another way. What if someone comes after me again? Don't even joke about that. I'm not, I need you. You'll have Sebastian. I can't accept this. Admit that you love me and maybe I'll stay. What? It's too much, I can't. Not right before the wedding. Tell me, Allie. I can't say that, Felix. I'm sorry. Then I will. I'll always love you, Allie, always. Wow, goodbye. Go to bed with Felix before you lose him forever or just let him go. They need to chill, episode gotta chill. Um, I'm just gonna let him go. <sighs> Bye Felix. I am not in a good mood. A few hours later. I'm so excited to be marrying you, finally. Me too. We've been so caught up in Malcolm's power trip that I almost forgot to give you my wedding gift. What did you I wanted to show you how much I love you now. Just like you've shown me that I'm the only man for you, right? Right! I'm gonna agree. We're getting married. Of course you're the only one I want. And you've already given me this baby. I don't need another gift. Too bad, because you're standing in it. What? The stables? And all the horses in them. You once told me you love learning to ride horses with your mom. I did tell him that, Oh. Now you'll be able to breed these horses, raise them, and ride them forever, along with our child. Oh, do you like it? Of course. I love him, and I love you so much. Aw, us. Like you said, you're giving me a family. He loves the baby so much already, so cute. But does he really love me? You okay, Allie? I guess I'm just wondering why you want to marry me. Uh, for starters, you're the mother of my child. I know, but what do you love about me? Allie, I just gave you a stable full of horses for our family. Are you doubting me? No. Look, you're an incredible woman and I love you and respect you. And I think you feel the same. Isn't that all that matters in a marriage? Uh-oh, she's thinking long and hard. Okay. The woman who inspires me is Allie. She's sincere, honest, daring, and she's so much more. She's the best of us because in truth, She's magical. And all of our lives will be forever better for having Allie in them. <laughs> I miss Felix. Allie, why do I feel like I gave you the wrong answer? No, uh, you didn't. I know you love me. I mean, I have to save some of the mushy stuff for our vows, right? Yeah, of course. It's lame that I asked. Forget all that. And thank you for this. I love my gift. Unfortunately, I have to get back to some business. Go. I'm just gonna stay here and visit my new horses. Aw, she's so excited, but like, conflicted at the same time. Felix and Sebastian both love me, but in different ways. God, why is this so hard? Maybe you shouldn't fall for two men. Like, don't get too used to your portrait hanging there. Sebastian was planning to take it down. Oh, now that you're gonna be king, there will be no need. Is that what you wanted to see me about? No, there's something we need to discuss. I have no interest in talking anymore. Oh, I want the throne. And you'll have it, but with me by your side. What do you mean? You aren't ready to lead, Malcolm. You're not well. You dare to call the rightful king unfit? The sad truth is, you're in no shape to handle the pressure of ruling, but I can ensure you succeed. The, the this, it's un unacceptable. Why doesn't he know how to talk? We are playing a dangerous game, Malcolm. You know you don't have a true right to the throne. What? I, I do. I practically died for it. Fight me and I will make you pay. Oh? 
That would be enough. Who is this? Oh, thank you, Ace. You will not threaten your mother. Malcolm is just unsettled, my love. He will not hurt me. Says who? Whoa, says me. I'm your father, Malcolm. What? Ace is... Wait, Ace is his dad? What? That just shook me. A secret that no one else will ever know. And that I wish wasn't true myself. King Malcolm III should have been my father. It's what the entire kingdom believes, including my brothers. That doesn't change the truth. So he's not the rightful heir for the throne. Wow, the tea is boiling. And whether you are king or not, I will always protect my queen. Listen to us, Malcolm. Do as we say and this kingdom will be yours. We need to find out about that. I need for Allie to like eavesdrop. Aw, look at us. This was from the first time Sebastian surprised me. We went on a hot air balloon ride. Oh, cute. I knew I was in love with him that day. No one had ever treated me like he did, and still does. Uh-oh, but Felix never backs down when it comes to me. He was the first person who really protected me when I got to Basilia. I'll never forget him taking me on the tour of the palace. We were in these ridiculous outfits, hiding in plain sight, but I felt like myself again, and now he's gone. I care so much for both these men, and I'm about to get married, but, is it to the right guy? Yes. They keep pushing me to like Felix. Oh, Lily, I miss you so much already. Mm, what should I do? I wish you had the answer. I miss Lily. Sebastian and Felix are both so wonderful. I just don't want to let anyone down. The person you really need to worry about is you because you're going to be a mom soon. And you have to do everything possible to make sure you are happy so the baby can be happy too. I miss this conversation. Gosh, Lily, you always know exactly what to say. It's a gift. I miss her! You're totally right, Lily. I wanna be happy, so I know what I have to do. What do I have to do? Am I calling off the wedding? What am I doing? Whoa. They want me to like Felix. I'm going to the airport to find my other man. I'm trying to find Prince Felix Hamill. Please, it's important. I'm sorry, my lady, but the royal jet just left. Oh, okay, thanks. Well, I missed him. I can't believe I drove him away for good. Allie? <gasps> Felix! Felix! <sighs> Allie is so confused. What are you doing here? There's something I have to tell you about us. What? Oh, wait, it ended there? Huh, it seems like the game is trying to push me into Felix's arms, which I mean, I'm cool with. So the real tea is Malcolm is Ace's son. Malcolm isn't the correct heir for the throne, but nobody knows that. Oh, the tea, the tea, the tea. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, put a thumbs up and share it with your friends to let everybody know about this episode tea. Also, I think we have like two more episodes left before this one's over, which is kind of sad, but whatever. And don't forget to follow my social medias over here so we can talk about this. I have a lot to say. I miss Lily. I just, and don't forget to buy, stream, and download my song, Tragic, so we can do the giveaway and a movie night. And if you do buy it, make sure to send me a little screenshot so I can add you to our Fitzfam group chat. So have a great day in the name of the Lord, and may God bless you every step.